This four Aquarius, sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign. This four Aquarius, sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. My name is D. Reader, the Million Dollar Tarot. Once again, for those of y'all that are new, and welcome to the Million Dollar Channel. Let's see what's coming in for Aquarius right now. If every single person is doing can tap the screen for me, that would be absolutely great, y'all. And if every single person can hit that share button and that follow button, that would be great as well. Let's see what's coming in for Aquarius. We got Hunts, Alabama. Thank you, Granetta. I appreciate you, baby. Thank you so much, Granetta. What's going on, y'all? What's going on? All right, all right, all right. Let's see what's coming in for Aquarius right now. So we got the Two of Cups in reverse, and we got the Queen of Swords facing forward. So with the Two of Cups in reverse, that's basically a water energy. Some of y'all could be dealing with a water sign. Some of y'all could have decided to leave a connection as well. So this pretty much indicates breakup. This could be with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, or this could be with another air sign. We got the Queen of Swords, so that could be your energy, especially my Aquarius women. You know, the Queen of Swords is, you know, telling you to make a judgment pretty much right now without emotions. She she doesn't think with emotions. She thinks off of logic. So this is how a lot of my Aquarius are moving right now, especially my Aquarius women. And we also have the Fool in reverse, and we have Judgment in reverse. So for a lot of y'all, this is going through that self-doubt and that judgment energy. And this is also, you know, resisting certain energies that held you back at one point. Good evening, baby. How you doing? We got a lot of Gemini energy here right now. If we can have a Gemini sent in for an extension, y'all, we will definitely do Gemini again. Can everybody that's viewing tap the screen, y'all? And we got the Emperor, which is Aries energy. And we got the Emperor in reverse. So some of y'all are dealing with the Aries, but things aren't going the way you want it to go between you and this Aries. This is where a lot of y'all are at right now. And we also have the Two of Wands, and we have the Seven of Swords. So some of y'all are dealing with a fire sign, right? It looks like things could be coming back together between you and this fire sign. With the Seven of Swords, there was some type of betrayal. There was some type of deception. There was some type of separation. Dealing with an Aries, okay? So we got some of y'all that are resonating. For those of my Aquarius that are resonating with this message or would like to send an extended message, feel free to send a tip or distinction to the CA, y'all. And we also got the Two of Swords. And we got the Two of Pentacles in reverse. So, for those of y'all that are dealing with an air sign, whether this is another air sign, whether this is a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius, and then we got the Two of Pentacles in reverse, so some of y'all could be dealing with a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn. This is where a lot of y'all are at right now. So, a lot of y'all are dealing with Aries. We got a lot of Aries energy here right now. Let's see what else is coming in. Hey, Cherish. What's going on, Cherish? And then we got the Eight of Swords. So, the Eight of Swords indicates pretty much like negative thoughts. Self-imposed, restrictions, imprisonment, and what's going on, my baby? How you doing? I was waiting on you. You miss Gemini, but you already know what to do if you want Gemini. I see you. And then we also have the high priestess. So this is where a lot of my Aquarius is at right now. Thank you, babies. I appreciate y'all. Yes, we do got to do scenery. We done switch things up. We're going to add some more to it, too. I'm about to give y'all a little bit more. I'm trying to give y'all more. I'm trying to give y'all some more. And we also got the King of Knight of Cups. So, for a lot of y'all, this is Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. This is where a lot of y'all are at right now mentally. This is where a lot of y'all are at right now spiritually, emotionally. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate y'all. And if every single person is doing right now can tap the screen and hit that share button, that would be great, y'all. Let's see what else is... Dang. Let's see what else is coming in for Aquarius right now. Thank you, thank you, thank you, babies. I appreciate y'all. Y'all are the best. I'm telling y'all. So, we got Shine Your Inner Light Brighter. And we also have Babe and Divine. What's going on, Cherish? What we doing, baby? And we also got Make the Best of Every Situation. So, some of my Aquarius is, no, not yet, baby. Some of my Aquarius is in a dark situation. Some of my Aquarius is in a dark place. But, be still so that God can hear your prayer. Some of you are praying, but you're not allowing your prayers to be heard, y'all. All right, y'all. Don't forget, y'all, it's 20 free, it's five free questions a week, 20 free questions a month, just from hitting that star button. We got about 50 slots open, y'all, because a lot of people are needing to renew their subscriptions. So we got a lot of slots open, so it's room for everybody. And we also got follow the path that is right for you and walk away from illusions and towards the truth. So for a lot of my Aquarius, right now at this moment, Go in the direction that you want to go and focus in on what the universe has in store for you right now at this moment. That's going to be extremely important for Aquarius. 
Not yet, baby. And we also got connecting with the living water. And not yet, baby. But y'all can't see me. I appreciate y'all. And we also got to take care of the little thing. And God will lead the way. So for a lot of my Christians, if you're wanting to get to a better place mentally, if you're wanting to get to a better place emotionally, if you're wanting to get to a better place spiritually, you have to allow God to help you get there. At the bottom of the deck, we have gentleness is the path of peace. Quit being so hard on yourself and quit being your biggest critic and face your future with boldness and strength. I appreciate you, Aquarius. Thank you.